y'all welcome back to my channel thanks for tuning in today um, I'm gonna be doing a quick uh, makeup tutorial with Jackie's palette Jackie 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 with um, Anastasia Beverly Hills so let's go ahead and get started I'm just gonna ahead and moisturize my face um, I'm using formula 1006 my moisturizer from Ulta then I'm gonna go ahead and go in with my primer also from Ulta this is by Essence Prime Studio um, this is a mattifying, I think the black clay one. Also love it. Uh, my T-zone is really oily, so this is perfect for my oily girls. Keeps you matte and dry pretty much the entire day without like having to reapply powder or anything. So it's perfect. Um, I went ahead and did my eyebrows off camera just by Anastasia Beverly Hills. Cleaned them up with some concealer from MAC. Just gonna go ahead and start blending that in with my beauty blender using my LA Girl um, Pro Conceal for my uh, hyperpigmentation just to get some of those dark spots from around my mouth. Going and blend, blend, blend. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and get started on my foundation. I use two. So I use my MAC Pro Longwear NW45 and I also use my NARS All Day Luminous and that's in the shade New Orleans. So I mix those two together to give me like the perfect shade because you guys know as African American women, we have an outer shade and an inner shade for our faces. So it gives me like the perfect combination. Next, I'm just going to go ahead and um, conceal. So I usually conceal under my eyes, the bridge of my nose, um, sometimes um, my jawline, which I started recently doing to just give like more structure to my face, which I really like. So I'm just going to keep blending that, making sure everything flows together and it's seamless. Next, I'm just going to be taking some powder to set everything. I love to use Ben Nye's Topaz is the color. I've been using this for a while as well, just with a little mini blender. Just get under um, my eye, my eyes. Um, I'll hit the bridge of my nose and of course my jawline again. Pretty much everywhere where I can feel that. I love this shade. Um, it isn't as light as banana powder which is what I originally started using and yeah, that looked horrible in pictures. So I just found something that was a little more chocolate girl friendly in pictures and in videos. So I didn't get that flashback. I got this off of Makeup Mania like years ago. Seriously, I think I got this in like 2013 and it's lasted me this long. So it's definitely worth the money to spend on it. It's not that expensive anyway, but it's definitely worth it. I love it. I'm just going ahead and dusting off some of the excess powder. I don't really bake too much. I just like leave it on there and then wipe it out. Um, so I'm going to go ahead and start contouring with my Fenty Beauty. I'm in the shade Espresso. Beauty blender again, and blend that out. My nose, cheekbones, and under my neck. Go 
ahead and just spray my face with some um, setting mist matte spray from NYX. I do this before I apply like my blush and then after. I'm going to go ahead and get started on my eyes. I'm using Urban Decay um, Primer. So the colors that I use in the palette I listed here, um, one through four. Um, the first one, my transition color, I use Ginger, followed by Edges. And then I created my crease with Credit. And then I just did my um, tear duct with Zam. And I'm also using my MAC 224 blending brush. My go-to every time. Perfect brush. I did go ahead and add Ginger as my lid color. So it's my transition color as well. And I really liked how it turned out. Next, I'm just going to go ahead and go in with my e.l.f. eyeliner and just line my eyes with that in jet black. Adding some mascara. Favorite lashes from Ardell Studio Effects. Duo Lash Glue. I used to not be able to put these on with tweezers, but now I'm like, this is the only way I can put them on. <laughs> so just pop my lashes on. I'm almost done. I'm gonna go ahead and add Zam to my waterline. Open my eyes just a little bit. I mean, I have small eyes, so. I'm adding some blush. This is also for Makeup Mania. <laughs> now it's highlighter time. This is also from Fenty Beauty. This is in the shade Cinnamon. Just get um, my upper cheeks, above my eyebrow, tip of my nose. Sometimes I'll do above my lips. Today I decided to just to give it a little extra. <laughs> I'm lining my lips with NYX's Pretty in Pink Lip Pencil. And then the lipstick I'm wearing is my favorite, World from MAC. I did go back in with my favorite highlighter from MAC, um, Rice Paper, just to brighten that area up some. Here's my finished look, just kept it really neutral. Hope you guys enjoyed this makeup tutorial. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.